What's up everybody? This is Roth. We are in the Nexus now. We have Smartax, our DPS warrior, Malmanez, our holy priest, Unseen, our rogue, and Venetrix, our DPS hunter. I'm gonna throw some music on and uh, I'll explain the boss fights once again. And I hope you enjoy the clip. <laughs> Alright, we're at the first boss, Grand Mages Telestra. What's gonna happen is you're gonna DPS her down at 50%. She's gonna split into three forms. There's Arcane, there's Fire, and there's Frost. The Arcane will sheep and stun people. The Fire will just blast people. And the Frost will do those sneaky Frost slowdown traps. What you wanna do is DPS the Arcane down first, then the Frost, then the Fire. After that, she's going to go back to normal form, and she's going to bounce you guys around, and you just want to DPS her down through that. The fireballs are kickable, so if you're low on DPS and if it's a new group, you want to try to kick the fireballs as much as possible to avoid all that AoE DPS, and loot up after that. the next boss now anomalous all right what's gonna happen next is he's gonna start summoning charges and you want to DPS him down it's like the mag T fight uh, burning crusades he's gonna be immune to all effects as long as the charges are up and he's still gonna be attacking people so what happens is you DPS the charges down and DPS the few ads he throws out and then you get him down after that, it's pretty much a loot up and tank and spank. So enjoy the fight. boss now, Amrock the Tree Shaper. He's going to have ice spikes and a few adds. You're going to see the ice spikes on the ground if you have your spell detail up before they come up. You're going to want to avoid them as much as possible because they will throw you up into the air. You'll take fall damage and you'll take spike damage. So you want to avoid the spikes as much as possible and destroy the adds.
for you, DJ. I will come running, running every night. You say you want me, I will make it right. I will come running, all you ever need. Our love is dawning, look outside. We're at the final boss now, Kara Straza. You want to have your tank sitting there while everybody else opens up the orbs. Tank's going to pick him up, and DPS are going to, melee DPS are going to stay on the sides. He is a dragon, so he has a frontal swipe and a tail swipe. Tanks want to make sure that they t strafe to the left or to the right when he does the ice debuff. This way you can avoid getting a stacking debuff on you, and you want to make sure that the DPS are not near the tail. After that, loot up. Uh, thanks for watching the clip, and I hope you enjoyed it. If you're buzzing, I'll try, yeah? You got them naughty little things in your body? I'll try. What are they saying? I'll try. You're fucking screen free.